So that was my first experience. And when I went back to Nepal, they came to know that I have experienced a big earthquake tsunami in Japan. So when ex earthquake expert people get, get together, they called me to share my experience. And I also uh, spoke out about my experience. So earthquake is a, a disaster which is a man becomes helpless you don't know what to do, you know? You don't know when it stops, you don't know what will happen. So it makes you very helpless. If there is a lot of rain, maybe you can run at the side. If there is a lot of wind, maybe you can go into it. But when they're reducing, you don't know what to do. <laughs> so four, four years ago in Nepal, Big earthquake. Where, where are you? But when the big earthquake happened in Nepal, I was not in Nepal. I was in France. And again, that was a different experience because I was in Paris and someone called me in the morning and said, There is a big earthquake in Nepal. And then I remember the earthquake here in Japan. So when you are outside, you worry even more, and you have no information, you know? So when, when the earthquake happened in Nepal, I was outside, but I was worried constantly, and there was no connection in the Kitai, no working television, no working. I cannot contact my family, and I don't know what happened. But I know when I was in Japan, there was a big problem. So I think maybe same problem more, because in Nepal, the houses are not strong like Japan. <laughs> uh, so I was worried. So I immediately canceled my tour and I went to Nepal. And we had uh, quite a bit of a problem. You know, there was a lot of building that fell, a lot of uh, 